My name is Manuela and I'm Senior Sales Manager of Fairmont Simpali and Resort in South Africa. Manuela, great to meet you. Um, thank you for speaking to Breaking Travel News. We're here at ITB. Can you tell me a little bit about what you've got in store for the next few days at ITB? ITP is very important for us because it's the first time that we as Fairmont Simpali are actually uh, participating. It's a new brand in South Africa and we are networking with the international and German operators for our exciting 2010. Okay, so Kurt, that's great. Can you tell me a little bit more about some of your plans in terms of the lodge? Uh, Fairmont Simbali is located on the north coast in KwaZulu Natal, to be precise, 43 kilometers north of Durban, and we're opening our new beach resort uh, in May this year. It is the first beach resort of its kind on the South African coastline, and with that I mean it is directly located on the beach with 154 rooms. Uh, it's a five-star deluxe, and apart from that, we have got nine different restaurants and food outlets. We've got a separate beach club and kiddies club plus our top range spa. So we are very, very excited about the opening. Well, sounds like an absolutely beautiful place. Now you won last year's uh, World Travel Awards were Africa's leading sports resort. How do you feel about that? How has it changed stuff for you over the past few months? It has changed a few things uh, because uh, with the lodge, we have our 18-hole uh, Tom Weisskopf champion golf course. We've got other sporting facilities, you know, like tennis, like horse trails, like uh, beach walks and uh, mountain trails. Uh, and it is just a very uh, good international recognition in the market for which we are very proud. And, and yeah, amongst the opposition in South Africa, it is a very great uh, honor for us to have uh, won this award. Well, that's wonderful to hear. And obviously we've got the 2010 awards coming up so so what are you doing to ensure that you uh, secure that award again for this year well certainly we hope with the new beach resort uh, as I said it is honestly one of its kind of, of a resort which South Africa has not yet had and the massive and very large development we have alone seven swimming pools at the hotel, which are all terraced. And so it is one of the significant uh, developments uh, in South Africa. Of course, there are a lot of others, but nothing like that. And we open in May, which is the Indaba month, uh, followed by the World Cup, of course, which is crucially important for the whole country. And we certainly hope that we are in the running again. Well, I'm glad you mentioned the World Cup because that was going to be my final question. Tell me a little bit about it. Are you um, hoping to uh, attract people coming over for the World Cup to the hotel? The World Cup uh, is actually going very well, although it's logistically um, not easy for everybody. We've got a new Durban airport moving to the north uh, of Durban, uh, and that is then going to be located only 10 minutes away from Simbali. Uh, the new Fairmont Simbali Resort, we are selling directly to mainly top-end corporates and FITs. The sales is going very well. We are fully booked since January for the semi-final, which we can actually sell four times or more and also we have quite a lot of key games in Durban uh, the Holland game the Brazil Portugal game also the German game are quite quite uh, well booked with uh, occupancy already between 70 and 90 percent um, the lodge is contracted with match but we're also working very closely uh, with them and we are confident that we will have uh, key clients and a well run event uh, in the Kosulu Natal province and in the whole country. Well, I wish you the best of luck with that and also with the uh, World Travel Awards in May. And thank you very much for talking to us here at Breaking Travel News. Thank you. It was very nice talking to you.